Welcome back to BitNation's playthrough of Final Fantasy X and X2. I am Sam. And I'm Eric. And this is my smooth radio guy voice. How's it going, everybody? Definitely have a face for Just radio. A few oh, Jesus. What is with you and being scared of fucking lightning? Do we have to talk Are to you? Are you that scared? <laughs> when I was little, a fiend attacked me while I was swimming at the beach. My brother tried to beat it back with a spell. <gasps> but he missed and hit me instead. It was a thunder spell. <laughs> <laughs> That's wow. unfortunate. I've been scared of lightning ever since. That's very but unfortunate. It can be effective. Magic is effective against marine fiends. My brother said that too. You should learn some spells, too. Ah! Ooh. So if you progress mm. it and make Riku learn some spells? Maybe later. No. Hmm? Nice to see you again. Why would they talk Welcome about it, to the Rin Travel Agency. Uh. Oh. Mm. <laughs> He's like... Hey, look, you're a fucking Alben. She's like, shut that shit down, bitch. Damn. What? See, I had thought that to mean, like, oh, he personally knows her. Dude, quit creeping, brah. What the fuck are you doing, dude? Are you trying to, like, squeeze into the door? Like, through the fucking yes? keyhole? Damn, she's playing with her fucking Guado vibrator. <laughs> Did you not see it vibrating up on that desk? Dude, hashtag caught. <laughs> this is what you find in one of those threads. She got caught. Hashtag vibrator. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have uh, come in. Uh, she's Guada Habit. Hey! Woohoo! Uh, just go Guado guy? Or Demolition Man style. Uh, yeah! <laughs> John Spartan, you'll be fine. Ten credits for it laughing. Says, Take care of my blah, blah, blah. Huh. John Spartan, you've been fined one half credit for a violation of the verbal morality like clause. His son, Seymour? <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck shit. Piss, bitch, ass. Um, <sighs> Toilet paper. <laughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> For anyone who doesn't know, you need to find out. You need to watch Demolition Man hardcore. Yep. Yeah. At a video store or Best Buy or whatever near you. Smell my stomach, asshole. Smell it. Uh, he shouldn't be holding his chocobos at all. Sounds very uncomfortable. <laughs> Hold your chocobos. Because they're trying to be like horses. No, not his huevos. Not his huevos. His are horses. We, are we talking about choking the chocobo? No! We're not talking about choking the bow. There's you in there. Yeah, but fuck that. <laughs> then let's just go on with the journey, huh? We're not through the Thunder Plains yet, so be prepared, alright? So, so we have to hit each of those Did stones have a fight? and then go to some tower? Yeah. No, no. That's talk to you. She's not going to move unless we do something. Um... Punch her in the not face? Stopping, is it? No! Don't it's called the Thunder you Plains, you stupid. I'm sorry. Fine. Stay here. Alright already. But you didn't have to say it like that, you know. You could be more comforting or something. No. You know, try to cheer me up. He doesn't want to get in you your pants. You just don't get me at all, shit. do you? But we do, right? Hey, are you listening? Her shorts. 
I don't know, dude. For someone who's lived in the water or near the water as much as she has, that could look like like the mouth of like an octopus. You ever seen the mouth of an octopus? It's like this. If you go to if you go to stick it in there, dude, the same thing will happen. So you're saying that by doing what the fuck an just happened? bed, it's like having sex with an octopus, and that its beak is gonna cut your dick off? Perhaps. I've always said that an octopus is like an underwater bird spider. And I hold true to that to this day. It sounds kind of weird. It is. But I want one. Well, you can't have one. Yeah, I know. Like, legally, I can't have one. You say more along the lines of your girlfriend has made it readily apparent that you're never getting one. <laughs> That's because I always bring it up. <laughs> You're like, can I get one? She's like, fuck no, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's because she doesn't want to die in her sleep, and I understand. That octopus could probably kill us. It needs, like, its own room. Farewell. Farewell. No time to waste. Let's go. Dude. I played Far Cry Primal again, like, the guy who does the voice, the same guy who does the voice of Adam Jensen from the Deus Ex games, and it's like, he didn't even try to hide it, he just uses the same exact voice. Like, wig job. Yeah, okay. That's a cactus, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, what the fuck is this thing? About to fuck me in the ass. Well, That's hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Before you switch out Titus, since he has that sensor ability, check it out. Okay, so half half damage for lightning, so don't hit it with lightning. So don't send it right out. Right. Mm. Or not Ifrit, uh, Ixion. Yeah. Send us about. Yeah. These bitches be crazy. Dude. No fucking Wookiee yawning in here. Somebody gets this walking carpet out of my way. And then his head is like, bitch. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> What was that? You know that's why, like, at the end of, uh, episode 7 after Han dies, he's just like, Oh, I know you need a hug, but fuck you, bitch. You and I I'm were never friends. By. Yeah, you and I were never friends. You <laughs> took him away from me, dude. <laughs> yeah. Like, fuck that bitch. This thing's got fucking almost 4,000 health. That's great. Nice. Oh! Holy ball titties. Damn. Nope. How goes that, Aeon? I'm sure you don't want to go, like, back to the hut? Oh, I probably will. I don't suppose Baka can do anything to him. Upgraded Lulu, now she has the, um, the better versions of the spells. Yippee! Okay. I swear, man. These are long. Lightning Pony is fine. Ice Lady's better. Why, you want to stick it up her butt? No. I'd never get it back. You don't know that. It would freeze in there. And that would be it. You might get a little bit of frostbite. Uh, and then I'd have to cut off the parts of my dick that were frostbit. No thanks. No. -uh. Get some frostbite treatment. No, dude. Just have a condom. That's like all thermal and whatnot. Yeah, man. 
You know, just have a, you know, woolly mammoth skin fucking condo. <laughs> Be uncomfortable for her, but who gives a shit? <laughs> right? She's some kind of dead alien spirit? I forget what they are. I think they go over it in detail at one point, but it's like, yeah, I don't, I don't remember. It's fucking something. Now throw a rock at it. Yeah! Yeah, we did it! Damn. We should have just done that at the beginning. Right up his butt. That overdrive would have killed him, like... No problem. Yeah, yeah. Ifs, ifs, Touch the... and butts and coconuts. <laughs> Touch the stone. I'm doing it. Okay. Yeah, you did it. All right, are we gonna touch all of them? Oh no! Fuck what? Me sideways with a rubber hose. Can we bail? Oh. <laughs> Apparently not. Wow. <laughs> 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 She's got a better sense of loyalty than Waka does. Listen, I'm your guardian, but... <sighs> I left my coke stash in my other ball. Later. Jesus. Whoops. <laughs> Damn, man! That was ice cold! Why did she not run? I don't know. Weird. Why didn't she run? Why didn't she do things, guy? Don't save. Or is it when we save is when all of our shit is regenerated? Oh, you just have to touch the glowy orb thingy. Oh. Oh, it just came to my pants. Well. Okay. What? Nothing, bro. Sound like you're some kind of But look, now it's all bitch. Wait. Did you what? see that? It was all glowy and then it wasn't again? Think later, Yuna. Do we have to touch them when Here, give me that cheaters guide for cheaters? Do we have to touch it when it's glowing? I don't know. No no, the other one. Or no, it says right there, that's how you go about getting it. But it also says it on the other page. Oh, what are you? Oh. I just get out here. Stand at any stone and press square to see the spirit of the Quatar. Well, released. After activating three stones, find the ghost flying just above the ground. In the south, you follow it to a small ruined lightning tower, and then you press square to send a bolt of lightning to the tower, revealing a treasure chest. That's how it's done. Sound like you're getting some powerful hater raid there, buddy. Damn, dude, that Waka Ball, Waka World Champion, that's badass. Yeah, dude. The Onion Knight, cool. That's Lulu's cool thing. Yes. Biff. What you gonna do now? Nothing, cause you silenced. Is 
So, how shall we do this? All of them. Go with the flow. Go with the flow, bitch. Oh my god, that's a lot better. <laughs> Very nice. Gotta wipe some cocaine if he knows. Yeah. Oop. Oh man, she could have done silence attack again. Doesn't seem to work on. Oh yeah, it does. Yeah. Right. Work for the other guy. Why would you do that? Because it didn't occur to me until after I did it. <laughs> Don't use a what? Oh, sorry. I didn't know that that I didn't I didn't know we were steering away from OP attacks. Yeah, it also costs way more magic. I don't know if you noticed. I can't Not exactly notice. fucking pissing no magic noise. shards all over the place here. Man. I didn't notice how uh, um, over how awesome I am. Little class effect of drama, though. Mm. <laughs> Oh, mm. Mm. <laughs> Square? It's, it's square, right? Yeah. Maybe when it's glowing, the glowy glow. There. Don't press square, press X when it's going. Press, it's a press square. Yeah, but maybe, if this is for the previous version of the game. Maybe it's different in this one. Either way, we should probably finish this episode. Bring it on! What? Bye. Now that she does so much freaking damage. Never mind, I guess. <laughs> Lasers? I guess it was just Yuna. Maybe you have to have a certain speed to get away from the monster. There! No, square. We done did it. Yay. You know what this means? We have to go all the way back to the beginning. What is it here? What is it doing? He has sensors, so I'm gonna see what's what. Nothing. You can defeat it before it gets away. Okay, okay, okay. Use Yuna immediately. Use a big attack. Don't be stingy. Need a light? <laughs> wow! Jesus! <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah, dude, Yuda, summon a did summon a thing. Not that one. Yeah, okay. Lightning unicorn. Holy crap, man. Wow. God damn. <laughs> Waka was talking shit and it was just like you did. Holy shit, dude. How does that make you feel, man? Like are you just filled with like impotent rage right now? No. Just like there's not much I can do. Waka's just a piece of shit cokehead. This little cactus puppet just fucked me in the ass with a bunch of little dicks. Like a thousand little dicks, approximately. If I would have guessed them, like how many little dicks to fuck you. Like literally a thousand years. Yeah. yeah. Now Thor's hammer him right in the dick hole. I can't even see it because it's such a small little dinky thing. Yay! We killed it! Maybe they changed it so you don't have to be all super ridiculous and stupid. And then now we get the item. Yay! <laughs> you should fucking probably figure out Waka's situation. <laughs> that was brutal. Waka, are you okay, buddy? <laughs> oh man, do you need a timeout? Do you need, like, a bandage? <laughs>
You need to ride in the wambulance. <laughs> Alright, we need to call this one. That's why I'm saving, dude. Damn. Alright, good. Pay attention when I'm speaking at you. I... I... I uh, you know what? I apologize. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Thanks so much for watching. We will see you all again. Thunder? Really, Thunder? Right in the middle of the outro? Next time. Okay, bye. Peace out.